Hey guys, so in this video, we're going to be making ice cream cake. This recipe I got from a TV show called Hack My Life and Wilson's gone. He doesn't want to be in the video anymore. So, yeah, it's a really good recipe. Simple, delicious. Even an imbecile like me could do it. Wait a minute. Who wrote the script? Anyway, enjoy. Alright guys, so, first off, what you're going to need, some clear saran wrap type stuff, nice ice cream sandwiches, whipped topping, some form of cookie, I'm using vanilla wafers, and an ice pan, depending on what size you make. Make sure you have your dog come help. Next, you're going to want to struggle to open up your other ingredients. There we go. Let's get some of that whip topping out. Put a nice layer. think you're using too much, you're probably just right. The first time I made this, I used what I thought was a reasonable amount, and it wound up not being enough. Make sure to have it fight against you a good amount of the way. Because if it doesn't fight against you, well then you must be doing something wrong. That's how life works. Because life is conflict. And anyone that says otherwise is selling something. So we got our nice layer. Next up, ice cream sandwiches. Luckily for me, I've already checked from the first time I made this, and this pan is just wide enough for me to squeeze these in with twice. You want to 
keep your glass of tea nearby. It's not important for the recipe, it's just if you enjoy it, something to drink. Right up against the other one. Stick it down in there. And if it tear, the package tears right there in the middle and you have trouble getting it, well, that just means you're doing it right. You picked out the right ice cream. So we got a nice layer of ice cream sandwiches. And a nice layer of whipped cream. Well, that should be enough, right? Nah. You can never have too much whipped cream. As I said earlier, before I made this, and it was not enough. So I intend on not having that problem a second time. And you level it off as much as possible, flatten it out, make it all nice and even. We want to make it pretty. Right? Do we? Is that a thing people want when they're making things? Oh, always clean off your utensils. Next, take whatever choice of cookie you use. And you got one of two options. One, you can either just straight up crush them on there. But, I did that last time. And I'm going to try and be a little smarter this time. So I'm just going to try and make a nice layer of vanilla wafers. Nice and whole. All across. See how it goes. Could be hazardous to our health. And remember, if you're not a diabetic after you finished eating this, then you didn't make it right. do 
Gotta stick it in the freezer for a few hours. Look at that. Nice and pretty. So we got our nice fancy dessert. Stick it on in there. Nice and freezery. guys it's been a couple hours and this thing is frozen solid so now the reason that we put this saran wrap on there first now your pan's nice and clean it, eat you a piece, stick it back in the freezer, and you've got ice cream cake. Take a nice look at it. It's very nice. Delicious ice cream cake. Caught red handed. Red handed and red apple. Quit, quit eating the fruit. Quit eating all the fruit. You was just gonna eat all the fruit on the camera, weren't you? You just gonna let me record you eating. You, you can't eat the camera. You cannot eat the camera. This is a vicious animal. He's very ferocious. His bloodthirst is unquenchable. 